During times of uncertainty, it's comforting to know we have a healthcare system in our community that's been committed to supporting us for well over a century. In this current time, we are standing together and our bond is stronger than ever. KDMC, caring for our community like no one else can. Uh, just come in every week with the same mindset. Just come in to work. Just stay patient when my time comes. Just got to execute. Just be ready. Neil, go ahead. Nick kind of asked what I was going to ask, Jonathan, but I'll, I'll follow up on it. Uh, how, how much progress have you made in, in your mind in terms of getting consistent? Like he said, you've had some games where you had big games and then you fell off a little and then you came back with another big game. Where are you in terms of becoming consistent in your opinion? Uh, just focus on the little things. Just go out to practice, focus on the little things I can try to fix. Just make sure I look every while and then run good routes. Just keep trying to only get better every week. As I just try to keep the same mindset. Has it been easier to do that this year with you guys, you know, passing more often than you did a year ago in, in that offense that was so run oriented? Well, yes, sir. I feel like I got a um, year under my feet, so everything's going by um, much faster now. So everything's more smooth. So the offense is is better. So everything's getting easier for me. Go ahead. Jonathan, Coach Kiffin was talking about uh, wanting to see the guys get better, see the offense get better in the red zone. Uh, what can you guys do to be better down there? Uh, finish every drive off with a kick or a score. So we just try and finish. Like our goal is to finish every on red zone drive with a touchdown, but just try to finish every drive and a kick. Just capitalize because you don't get that many chances in the game. So just make the best out of your opportunity. What, what do you think is keeping you guys right now from, from finishing drives like that? I mean, what, uh, what are there mistakes being made in the red zone? What, what do you see there? Uh, mistakes by us because other teams not stopping us. We're stopping ourselves. So everybody just got to do their job. When we got to do our job, everything works out good for us. Go to John. What's it kind of like for you, like playing next to uh, a guy, you know, or – Obviously, in the same offense as a guy like um, Elijah, and how does that kind of open up things for you, like the talent that, uh, that he has? Uh, he's a good leader in the group. Like last year, he really wanted to vocal. He more like a, a lead by example type guy. But this year, he stepped up, being more vocal, trying to get on the air about if we're not doing right in practice. He a good guy. He like you know, he talks to me sometimes, tell me what I can work on. This is a little thing. Just give me advice about football. He pick up from AJ and DK. He just really like a student in the game. So. He just like masters his craft all the time. He just about his business, so it's good playing. Against, it's a good playing with him. Go back and Nick. You just kind of brought up AJ and DK there. Obviously, all three of you guys from Mississippi. It seems like every year there's a bunch of big receivers coming out of Mississippi. What do you think creates such good receiving talent in this state? Uh, I don't know. Just Mississippi always slept on. Um, just slept on state. I just feel like we just got hidden talent, and everybody's starting to see it now. That Mississippi has talent, just like people just got to discover. So it's good that AJ and DK doing what they're in the league, putting on for Mississippi, so everybody can be aware that Mississippi had good athletes. What goes through your head when you see those guys tearing up the league so young? It motivates me, cause you know what I'm saying. We're from the same state. Both we all played in 6A. Not a lot. I played the team they used to play. So like seeing them play in the NFL motivates me every day. It wants me to go out there and do better every week. Just trying to master your intensity. Go to David. Yeah, Jonathan, as screwy as all this COVID testing stuff is for you guys as players, as players, having the three-day break over the weekend, did you guys kind of lean on each other from accountability standpoints uh, to, you know, maybe maybe stay safe over the weekend, not be in precarious situations? Uh, yes, sir. We just try to tell everybody to go out there and stay safe. Really, like, just try to go spend time with our family. Don't try to go in the party. So just try to be safe. It's time to do more of what you want, where you want. With the all-new Honda EU 2200i generator, available at your preferred local Honda dealer, Frederick's Sales and Service. These generators are quiet, portable, efficient, and have the reliability you'd expect from Honda. Come by Frederick Sales and Service in Brandon and see the full line of Honda generators or online at fredericksales.com. Honda and Fredericks, power you can trust.